the other big element, I think it's always uh, in terms of connections where, um, you know, there's the, the, the Carlton building and the new towers. Um, so the new towers are connected between each other through the roof uh, deck pool. Um, that's a very, you know, significant um, architectural statement. Again, that was designed, uh, um, it was a collaboration with our, our input and uh, Shulman Architects uh, uh, that obviously uh, did it as well. Um, that was a, a huge statement because uh, not a lot of people when you're on the pool realize that they're basically suspended in thin air and supported by two columns, one on each side of the pool. Um, yeah, if you look down, you can see it, or if you're um, in, the, in the atrium downstairs and you look up, you realize that, wow, yeah, that's the pool structure up there. Um, so that's definitely an important uh, architectural um, uh, element that's in the new, the newer building of the Betsy. Um, the Betsy in itself, I think, um, the the name, you know, when I, it, it's strange, maybe, and maybe that's just me, but when I think, when you name the Betsy, I always go back to the original building. Um, I think it's a trick of the mind that I have, and it's the one on Ocean Drive, uh, you know, in the Floridian Georgian style, um, because it's such, a, it's such a statement um, on Ocean Drive. And in fact, it's still where all the guests, no matter if they're on the newer side, come in. Um, so the entrance to the Betsy and to the Betsy world is still on Ocean Drive, um, and it is in the original in the original uh, building. And that's probably the biggest feel and style of the Betsy. Um, the new buildings, um, because one was totally Art Deco and the other two were totally brand new. Um, there were there are certain elements that have been carried into the new buildings but you know definitely also the interior design was changed somewhat between the two the two buildings also uh, if i can add something uh, for example uh, connecting to what diamante was just saying uh, i want to mention for example one problem that we had that we couldn't solve <laughs> we had to give up was that um, from the interior um, uh, courtyard you know you've been in, in the courtyard the one at the carton side we wanted to recreate somehow um, uh, intro, you know bring somehow in also the the concept of the wood louvers that uh, were so uh, well perceived at the Betsy and uh, we wanted to by creating also some sort of uh, uh, privacy having this uh, wood screen you know like louver that would go all around the facade of the new building but um, they're not there because we there was no way we we tried to change the design many time and uh, i don't even remember what was the issue but they didn't let us do and we had to no. <laughs> yeah i i can't remember because the idea of the atrium where all the 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 rooms with balconies face uh on the inside of the building the addition of these um uh, louvered doors and louvered uh, and shutters um and i remember we wanted to do them in a teak color that would um you know would uh, harmonize and um warm up the space we weren't allowed to do it um for several reasons. Now I actually forget. And that's probably one of the things that, yeah, still bothers us. Yeah, <laughs> because this DVD would be a very good addition to the, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And also personally, one of my favorite, you know, since you were mentioning um, what are your favorite areas at the, the Betsy project, 
My favorite place has always been, Yamante knows it. Yeah, I know. Rooftop, not at the new building, the rooftop. The at building. building. The, the Betsy rooftop, uh, it was uh, maybe, you know, smaller, more secluded, more private, private and, uh, um, you know, it was created in a way that was screened from the back and you had this beautiful view of the ocean in front of you. And with this thick furniture uh, that we got into it, it was very warm and very welcoming. And there was a bar. I don't know if they, I think maybe they're closing it or they're reopening. And, that for me has always been at the end of every every long working day at the Betsy project, even it was 2 a.m. finishing an installation, I would go up there and just be <laughs> under the, the stars. That is, um, and over there, we mm-hmm. wanted, also there is another thing that we couldn't do. We wanted to bring up a little water feature. So there would have been an addition of a little water feature to bring in the sound of the, of the water, you know, to increase the relaxation experience. That is something as that uh, I don't even remember again why, but uh, no matter how strong we fought, we couldn't, we couldn't do. 